Hey, it's Amelia's day, and next up, she catches up with What's the rhymes. Check them out. Hey, Amelia Moore here with none other than Buster Rhymes. What's up? Word up, word up. What's up? What's up to the 411 world out there? We getting busy representing Buster Rhymes in the house. Yes, indubitably. Um, Buster, I want to ask, what's going on with you? I mean, I hear you've got a label, production. What, what's going on? Buster Rhymes has just confirmed a new little business venture. Now I'm affiliated with Rowdy Records, Arista Records, and um, we got this little production deal going on. And uh, the name of my production company is Flip Mode Entertainment. And we're just trying to bring forth another way we can channel what we believe, what we think about, how we get down, how we like to channel energy. And the energy that we channel is hip hop. You know what I'm saying? And we're trying to just have people see another side other than us, the artist side of how we get down. And being that this whole business is based around what the artist manufactures, you know what I'm saying, as an art form, we got to be more in control or at least strive to put ourselves in a position to be more in control of what we do as an art, which is hip hop, rap, you know what I'm saying? Exactly, I mean, I think one of the biggest points that um, I have with a lot of people is that hip hop is a lifestyle and rap is a derivative of that. No and unfortunately, lots of times, people who are in those positions that execute those decisions don't understand it because they don't live it. Definitely. So, I mean, I think it's really fly that brothers like yourself are taking it to another dimension and looking back and pulling up the fly flavor that's, you know, in the hood. Definitely. Definitely. Yeah. Who's, who's some of the new artists that you're working with? Um, we're going to be debuting Rampage, The Last Boy Scout, featured on the Flavor In Your Air remix as the newest face on the boob tube, you know what I'm saying? And um, he got an album, that's tour, it's called um, Red October. It should be scheduled for release sometime in March of 95. His single will be out February, following up the flavor in your remix, how he represented real thoroughbred, letting people know flip mode is the squad and we in the house for 95. Bust the rhymes things. Now let me ask you, what's going on with leaders of the new? Leaders of the new school will never die, regardless what people think. You know what I'm saying? A lot of little false information was circulating about how we broke up and we ain't getting along. You know what I'm saying? But in every situation in life, you got to go through the love and hell to come out right. right. And one thing about leaders of the new school is we done been through so much hell that it ain't nothing but love. So with the uh, end of the third quarter, beginning of the fourth quarter, 95, which is somewhat in the fall, winter time of 95, there will be a junior effort album. Album number three from Leaders of the New School as we bring it in another lifeline format. Letting y'all see how we bringing it as a group and as a union and as a, as a force that's coming with just endless flavors. And we just gonna let y'all see how we bring it as a family thing, how Leaders of the New School, Rampage, Buster Rhymes, Brown also is coming with a solo album. You know what I'm saying? And we all just going to try to incorporate and venture the ability that we have as a unit as well as individuals because that's what it's about. Now you've taken it, I mean this man is just the entrepreneur, okay? Now you've got production company, you've got your artists, but you're also into movies? No question. Buster Rhymes has first been blessed with an opportunity to be in the HBO Strap special with Fred Joe Starr from right. Onyx and Bo Keem Woodbine from Jace's Lyric and um, we got put on by Forrest Whitaker and that was my first opportunity to actually see what it was like reading scripts and trying to play the role of another individual and it's, it's real cool to be involved with that because it's just another form of how to challenge pieces of you that people don't really get the opportunity to see then you know we was blessed by Ed Lover and Dre on Who's the Man as leaders of the new school and now John Singleton blessed me on Higher Learning which will be coming out January 13th with Ice Cube and Omar Epps and Christy Swanson and Michael Rappaport and Lawrence Fishburne and and uh, and uh, yeah, Regina King and yes, yeah, it's, it's definitely Cock Diesel. So there you are. You're getting the 411 with Buster Rhymes on all his entrepreneurial stuff. And as an example, it's not only just an art form; it's also a business, and you need to be on it. We out. Hey! This is the squad for 9 5. Rampage, the last Boy Scout. Stay tuned for the Buster Rhymes solo project coming spring 95. Word is bomb. Alright? Hey!